I might get a chance tomorrow to try out my new Snow Joe snow shovel. So I'm gonna go ahead and unbox it. This is just some bolts probably for the handle. Right. Instructions. Charger. So I want to get that charged up and ready for tomorrow. Say in one to two inches, we'll see. Been looking forward to trying this out. I actually uh, got a couple of Christmas presents for my boys. Um, I got them these what these as well. I did do a little bit of looking online before I purchased it, but uh, they were a price I couldn't resist. So we'll see if it's worth it. that on charger. ribbing in it so that you can only go one direction with it. So. Here you'll find this just a little bit difficult uh, to connect and the only reason is this wire that goes through it. They made it a little bit longer so that it would be able to uh, be folded and you have to just uh, force it just a little bit. I guess that's all there is to it. This part here looks like it can be removed if you need to replace it. It's just plastic. So I would imagine that this uh, this could get beat up pretty good if you're pushing it on concrete. This is just plastic. Um, this is kind of a rubberized plastic top here. But uh, next thing uh, is to test it. Try it out on the sidewalk in the driveway. Hopefully we'll get snow tomorrow. We'll see. See if I get to try it out. I will say that it was really great for working around small areas like this in between cars and uh, where we had already parked on the driveway and then the sidewalks uh, as well.
right, it's still still going strong. Um, uh, a couple things I, I didn't know about before I started. Number one, how long this battery would last, and number two, uh, how how far it would throw the snow. If it would be number three, would it be better than a shovel? So, um, is it a uh, what what you would consider a true snowblower? No, it's uh, it's definitely not that because you only get uh, ten inches a swath, and uh, that's uh, that's a lot a lot of walking. Uh, even you know a normal shovel is maybe a little bigger than that. So. But uh, is my back bothering me as much as it would be on a normal uh, shoveling? Uh, no, not at all. I did learn uh, a little bit of technique in using it. When I was doing that driveway over there, uh, technique being that uh, number one, you want to find out which direction the wind's blowing. And uh, number two is uh, I, I learned to start from the top and kind of angle it slightly so that it was throwing it away. I ended up doing that driveway twice. so. This battery, and it's got one bar left, you can see that, it's got one bar left on this tester. Um, this battery is still good, and I did that twice. So I, I've done a full three-car garage driveway plus mine and my driveway and my sidewalk. So the um, battery held up really well. I was uh, really uh, surprised at that. I didn't expect it to go that long. So um, uh, Other than that, the Snow Joe, um, is it worth the about $100 uh, that I paid 80 I think, for? I got a, a little bit of a deal at Sam's. Uh, is it worth that? Uh, I would say, yeah, if it continues to work and I'm able to use it for uh, a few years, I'd say it's well worth that. So, um, again, it's not a snow blower, not a true snow blower. It's more of a snow shovel, a power shovel, I guess you could call it. And uh, and it, uh, it did the trick. So. This is the Snow Joe and this is my review.